Oh, this basket's cool. Now, what do we have here? <laughs> uh, what the <laughs> <laughs> There's like coins on it that say India, and it looks like it was hand done, and this was wrapped in it, so maybe it was like some ritual thing. I just want to know what the heck this thing is. Ooh, this is cool. More treasures, maybe from India. This is cool, this little um, thingy me jig. Oh, I got it. A snake comes out of it, and that's like the music to get the snake out. Oh my God, if that's it, that is freaking awesome. Are you freaking kidding me? This is the music to trick the snake to come out. I'm definitely gonna have to see what these things are. These could be really cool finds. Do, 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 <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I'm taking these unique finds to the Nippur Academy. Hello. Hi. To see if Prachi and Khalil can tell me what I got. Yes. Wow, haven't seen those in a while. Really? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. The bean, the basket, and the blanket, they're all for snake charming. What kind of snakes? Cobras are very common in India. OK. We believe that snakes really don't hear, so they are not dancing to the tune of the instrument. Ah. Their scales feel vibration, ah. and when they move with the music, the snake will move, move with it. What is that called? It's a bean. B-E-E-N. So it makes music. It should. It looks like it's in working condition. It's tough to get sound out of this yeah. because the breathing has to be circular breathing to keep the sound going without any breaks. So it's quite a challenge to play, but we shall try. Hey, hey, it sounds like a <laughs> Yeah. So it's making good sound. sound. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So in terms of value, how much for all three of these put together? It looks like a whole package that's complete, not too bad of a quality. I would give it about $70. OK. You know, I was expecting a little bit more, but hmm. you know. <laughs> <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha